Gotta, gotta doodle my dongle down. Okay, here we are. Hello, everybody! And welcome back to Surviving Mars with me, Benjamin. You know me. Uh, so, I didn't realize it till... <laughs> I didn't realize it till just fucking now. Yes, T, T, Earl Grey Hot. It's right there. Can you actually see it without spilling it? You can see a little bit of it. Um, I didn't realize it till just this moment when I was starting up the game. But, uh, yeah, my old save file was on the new hard drive, so we're fucking starting again. But I'm fine with that because the, e the, the beginning part is the most fun anyway, so I I'm fine. We're still gonna do, uh, we're still gonna be some, yeah, some doomed, some doomed Martians for certain. Uh, I'm gonna put this on rando, mystery rando, logo, do it. Oh, well, I keep using family values, but, um, let's go with something. I like Mr. Handy. I like Mr. Handy. So we're gonna do that. Uh, okay, I think that's, um, fucking it. Not just regular, right? Fucking it. Alrighty then, um, or one probe, I think we're just gonna go with the standard startup here. Drone hub, uh, moisture doodlator, and fuel refinerator, and poop, uh, bloop into its bottom. When will XCOM return? Soon! Soon! Um, I think I might start doing XCOM on Fridays, actually. Been the most competent. Hey, hey, if you were looking for competence, you wouldn't be on my channel. You'd be watching a Roomba. Or Shen. Or Quill. Or Marbs. You know those guys. Who's got who got their shit in I'm just I'm just a shithead, guys. I'm just a shithead and you all know it. Alright, let's look for a site. Ah, 325. Let's see. Dust devils, dust storms. A lot of water, not a lot of concrete, good amount of metal. Uh, rough topography. Yeah, fuck it, let's do it. Fuck it, we're doing a- I watch Quill too. You watch- you watch Quill for competency, and me for- what the fuck is this? What is that right there? What am I looking at right there? What is that? What is that? What is that little black doodle? I don't know, there's a couple pixels there. Alright- oh, that's so okay, okay. Alright, we got, uh, we got a little bit of concrete and a little bit of metal here. Okay, um... Time to scan our doodle and see if we can find any water nearby, because that's what we need. Concrete metal. Okay, no water nearby. I like this big crater. That's pretty sweet. I watch McConnell for Primo U4. Who's McConnell? I'm gonna have to science, science the shit out of this. I don't know who McConnell is. I guess we just hit one of the nearby areas see what we can come up with all right yeah okay some more concrete and that's about it uh yeah I guess we'll just start here let's see which one of these is uh, got a bigger 325 all right that one's slightly better this one's closer to some crappy underground doodle so I guess we'll just pop down over here somewhere um, big open area, that's, that's fine. Twitch app on the PS4 changed the layout. I hate change! I'll see you, Ruger. Thanks for popping in. I seriously have no idea what this little... Like, what is that? What, what is that? It's, it's behind my hand. It's like a little... What the hell am I looking at? I don't know. Whatever. My water reserves just ran out. Oh no! And we'll make sure we scannerate the local area. Oh! They must have patched this. You could you could queue up a lot more scanning. That's pretty sweet. Kerploosh. Ben's going insane. I am going insane. Green screen looks good today though. It's nice, generally. Uh, okay, so... This stuff's... Oh, shit. Um, this, these guys are in my local area, but... 
So the only other place I could I could go grab some some doodles is over here. But is there any any spare doodles in my area? No, there isn't. So I guess you could just do that for now, and we'll get started. Uh, we're gonna do a universal depot. Just gonna plop that in right next to our landing site. Go go go, gadget doodles. Um, we're gonna need the dro well. Why don't we get a couple things laid down before we do that? Concrete extractor. Saw a 227 there. 232. 232 is pretty good. We'll go with that. We'll go with that. Hey, Zocker. And let's see. What do we got to start with? Drone. Well, none of this stuff is super interesting. I guess we could do drones. Scientists and botanists, and I guess, mm, yeah, I guess we could do that. Or, you know, let's do it like that. Let's, let's just set up a couple. What tips do you have for first-timer in XCOM 2 to keep their fighters alive? Uh, cover. Cover, cover. Keep, keep, keep people within, if possible, keep people in range of each other. You know, within, like, sprinting range of each other. Always use cover. Don't stand out in the open. Scouts. Gotta have your- make sure you got good scouts. Good scouts. Your mother's a bitch. Your mother's a bitch. Alright, so... Next thing to do is make sure we have, uh, not unlimited power. So I think we're gonna do a... A power area just over here. And what we'll do is we'll just set up... Six of these right here. Gonna draw that out. And then, nope, not there. That's wrong. Uh, that's wrong. That one's wrong. Oh, eight, 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 eight. Um, there is where we'd want it. There, there, like that. That's where we'd want it. There we go. Okay, cool. Keeps thinking of saying your mother's a fish. That one wouldn't, it doesn't seem like it would make a lot of sense. It's great if you are good slash enjoy XCOM 2. X I think XCOM 2 is great. I mean, if you're if you're a salt lord like I am, it'll, it'll lead to fr some frustration, but I still love the game. Um, and because I'm probably not going to be continuing... To, to, to run Hearts of Iron 4 on Fridays, because, fuck it, it's Hearts of Iron 4, why the hell would I? Uh, I've got a I basically got a free slot on Friday, and I was thinking about return- what the fuck's going on here? About returning with, um, oh, there's something in the way. Well, get the hell- get it the hell out of the way. Oh, thank you! That's exactly what I wanted you to do. Um, returning with XCOM on Friday nights. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the drone- hub right there kind of centrally located <laughs> fuck it it's only four added <laughs> i've ha i think i've had all the fun i can have with the with the dlc before resorting back to uh to to just never ending salt which you know nobody really likes nobody wants to see that it's it, it's fun temporarily but nobody just wants to see me raging at the game Oh, that's kind of in my way. I'll just do two like that. Normally, I would have lined them up. I'll fix this later. Uh, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put down just two wind turbines for starters. So I'm not really sucking down my resources. Love the XCOM series. I really like the XCOM series, too. Just bought XCOM DLC, but busy with Rule Britannia. Both excellent choices. Both are excellent. Come on, get some of this shit going. Oh, yeah, they're all busy doing other things. I need to get this guy turned on. Dismantle drone. Recalls a drone and dismantles it into a drone prefab. I don't think that button was there before. I don't remember that. Don't stop believing. I I never stop believing. Don't stop believing. 
Hold on to that feeling. I love Journey. I was able to get Portugal and France under a PU was England. Well, that's powerful. Doom! Wait, what did you think we wanted to see? You getting all salty or something? Makes my day bad. Well, I mean, I mean, I think I, I think I got enough salt stored up from that one until the next deal, the next shitty DLC hits. So happy I didn't spend a penny on the OE4 DLC. Me too. Keep forgetting about adding more work shifts. Yeah, yeah, I forget about that sometimes too. Uh, is this the, okay, we definitely need the scanner doodle. So, that's over here, I think. Sensor tower. Let's just pop it down over here. Kind of out of the way. Get a little bit of power stored up. Ah, oh, just in time for the fucking sun to turn off. But that's okay. The reason I bought it is because the game, the Mighty Jingles, was a show, a video on XCOM 2. And the base game brought me to Ben, so that was worth it. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. I bought the Hoi 4 Season Pass uh, a while back because I'm delusional. Oh, Spirey. Oh, Spirey, you poor son of a bitch. Oh, you poor son of a bitch. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Spirey. That's, that's, oh, that's, that's nice right there. It's actually a really, well, it's not great, but it's there. Is this the one I just, oh, yeah, that's the one I just opened up. You know what I would, you know what it would be really nice? If, um, two, two, two quality of life things I would like with this game. Is if you could toggle an actual, um, overlay grid on this map mode so I could see where the sectors were. And... If while I had this guy selected, I could I could right click on one of these and tell him to mine all of the resources in that that sector. Two things I would really love, I would really appreciate. But we've got plenty of time for quality of life improvements in this wonderful little game. Oh, and before before I forget, um, we got the pre preliminary shit set up for Mrs. Magnus's YouTube channel. There's nothing on it yet except for a banner. Which, uh, we made this morning. Um, but if anybody... I don't know if it'd be... Because the city there's nothing on it, it would probably be really hard to find. But Lady Magnus has a YouTube channel now. It's empty, but it's there, and we'll start filling it soon. You were the reason I bought Hoi 4. Oh god, I hate it when people tell me that! I'm so sorry! I'm sorry, I didn't know it! I didn't know what I was doing at the time! Alright, we gotta get some more shit set up here. I'm sorry! Don't hit me. Well, I mean, I guess in in all in all seriousness though, if you got enjoyment out of the game, then it's fine. Then it's just fine. As long as you got enjoyment out of the game. That's what's important. I'm gonna do two of these. Hey Samuel, thanks for the host. Guess the old well, uh, new new colony because I had because I nuked my hard drive and forgot to say forgot to transfer over the uh, the save file, which I did for, for which I forgot to do for several games. First two characters in XCOM 2 tutorial got killed off. Oh God! I've been having a lot of giggles at Drew's videos. Oh, I don't. I just oh, fuck. I bought Hoi 3 because of you, then I got Hoi 4 and it crushed my and after 270 hours it crushed my soul. Link to- can you link it to your channel? Um, I'll put a link to Mrs. Magnus's channel up soon. We just need to get a little bit more information settled before we do that. Get to get a little bit more stuff done. Or at least we got a couple places to research when it comes time. And you're cranking out some water, which means we need to start fueling. Unlimited fuel power. Fuel refinery. Let's actually leave just uh I mean I could squish it in a little a little better. Actually that's that's like fine like that. There we go, that's that'll that'll plug in. Hey Stephen Hawking. So there these Mormons bring their extra temple garbage to the, the sacrament meeting bin? I'm assuming they brought their magic underwear into space. 
I would just I would just naturally assume that's something that would come with you know you travel with you. Magic space underwear. All right, power, fuel, concrete, more concrete, and this is twelve per soul. All right, good, good start, good start. Uh, I probably can wait a hot second on getting other stuff up and running, so I don't have to waste a lot of time on um, sector scanned. Ooh, another anomaly found. on upkeep. Uh, will her alien isolation run be on YouTube? Yes, yes, that'll be on her YouTube channel. Oh, and well, we got a lot of concrete to work with. Gotta say it with <laughs> the Brooklyn accent, concrete. Still doing the yeah. This is a hundred, three hundred and twenty-five percent. I think we picked here. Gypsies in space. Oh God! Oh, I don't need that right off the bat. You shoot, shoot. Okay, thank you. I pro I I successfully shoot him away. Actually, what we can do here, because we got we got better sensor. Over this way, so we'll, we'll do it around this because it's over on this side. We got a better, um, quicker, quicker scanning, so we'll do it over on that side. All right, got a couple things to, to to deal with once once we can. Oh, we need a dumping zone too. Concrete, all that all all that shit uh, uh, brought up by our our concrete extractors. There we go. Huzzah! Still, uh, still space Mormons. Oh yeah. Of course we're still space Mormons. Why would we never be? Why would we ever not be space Mormons? I kind of skipped playing this game on easy and just went wait straight to as hard as I possibly could, which is probably why I suck at it. But at least I have fun. Oh yeah, we got a dumping. I was like, what are they doing? Right, we got a dumping zone now. Only seven. Ugh. Well, all we got is the, uh, the, the moisture vaporator. I really feel like when you turn... Well, I guess it makes sense. I was about to say, I really feel like when you turn machines off, they should stop taking maintenance. Maybe lower maintenance. You're lucky that you start that place where the meteor hit at? You didn't start at the place where the meteor hit at. Oh, yeah, like straight in the mid middle here. Although, who knows? It might be really rich down there. Ben, the new response to humanity against the consequences of climate change. Just shoot it away. Shoot it away. Exactly. You just go, oh, it's bad. Shoo. Go away, heat. Speaking of which, I got the... I wonder... I keep, I keep moving my head over towards these few pixels right here. Like, I'll be able to see what they are. Wait. Ah, I think I get, I think I know what it is. There we go. It's the, oh shit, I got, I got fuzzy. Oh, okay, I'm okay. It's the very edge of my desk. It's the very, very tip of my desk. Uh, ooh, we just found a buttload of new minerals. Cool. Nice. Red icon metal? Oh, yeah. That's underground metals. Like uh, an area where you can mine for them. They call it a mine. Alright, we're going to do a concrete depot over here. And a metal depot there. Huzzah. So we can actually start stocking this stuff up. And just make sure we don't get hit by any freaking dust devils. Yeah. This will be a good... Once this runs out... Nope, maybe. Maybe. Anomaly. Yeah. Not going to be able to get over to that one with what we got. Probably have to wait until we get the, the little... The mobile drone guy. Crater reminds me of the Rimworld session last night. Traders were expensive as fuck and I couldn't afford it. Seconds later, the guy hit uh, 
they get hit by pods and their muffalos dropped everything. I don't think I've ever been that lucky. A pod landing directly on some, some traders? Oh shit. Oh, it's just, it's just the tip. It's okay, it's just the tip, guys. I've had it before where, like, uh, a trader gets attacked by a wild animal or something like that, and then he throws a grenade into the middle of the party and everybody blows up. And then, and then they all die, and then I'm happy because they all died. Alright, how are we doing here? I believe I only have the one rocket this time. Yeah, I just got the one racket. Racket. How many polymers do I have? Oh, before I forget, don't put fuel in here. Because fuel could blow up. And you're never lucky. No. No, I'm not. Almost never. Sector scanned. Oh, that was nice, though. That was a little bit of uh, metal up in here. Ooh, yeah, we're we'll definitely going for that soon. Are you... you finished... Your, your little spot there. Grenade where all the friends are standing together. What could possibly go wrong? Well, it's it's RimWorld. Uh, little little, little RimWorldians aren't the smartest people in the world. They tend to they tend to do a dumb quite often. Hey, Utari. I can't wait to start up a new RimWorld colony. Probably wait till 1.0 comes out. The next update. Unload you there. Like how the metal is just like auto smelted into the perfect ingots. Oh yeah, I think Hey King Stubbers, I'm pretty sure I got unlucky and very lucky in uh EU four last Wednesday. So I, I, I probably used up all of my luck in that one go. Getting colonial Colonialism to fire in in, in 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 the Philippines, like by the skin of my teeth. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. Ooh, more anomalies. Good for me. We'll do this whole area. At least we got we got a lot of area we can get to. It looks like all of this and all of this, just not over here, because of this ridge line, and not in here. That it looks like there's enough room to work. We're at 34. So a little over half fueled. You, sir. Uh, right up over here. Weren't these, like, bright and shiny and, and like, silvery looking not a hot second ago? I felt like they were. Enough power to keep me going. I say the, the the textures they are have been were done really nicely. In the sky. Oh hey look, I'm now number one. <laughs> I'm sure that'll last. Stephen Hawking is now the number one cheerer on the week because it just reset. Sector scanned. Uh, last uh, midnight I believe. Star man waiting in the sky. Sand must have fallen. On. Oh yeah, everything gets dusty here. Although, as someone who's done this stuff before, I can I can generally find foibles in texturing and models and stuff just because I've done it before. Can't see it now. Suck it down! Okay, now, now Bandit's number one. Sorry, Stephen Hawking! My apologies to your position. Okay, concrete's going. Concrete. King Stubbers, number three? Thanks, kid Subbers. At least I'm on the board. Oh man, I thought I thought he was close enough to keep going to the next one. At least I thought he was. Star man, I was walking around with Penny outside a few minutes. Well, right before the stream started, not a few minutes ago anymore. But uh, singing that song, it's a great song. How are we doing? Forty-four. Nice. Good luck with getting the achievement. Oh, uh, I, I, I don't think it's going to be the hardest one. Hey! 
Stephen Hawking, there we go again. We've got a stunning upset here, folks. Stephen Hawking in the lead, I believe. Stephen Hawking. The line must be drawn here. Egg the blue shark. Thanks for the resub two months in a row. Appreciate that. Bitches better watch out. Oh, my. Man, the sky. Thanks, King Stubbers. All right, I think we just gotta wait for our next rocket, basically now. Rocket. Bandits number one. Thanks, Bandit. Right? No, no, Bandit, you're still number two. King Stubbers beat you because he just did it. There it is. Fight for my love! Uh, but seriously, thank you guys. Really appreciate it. That's why I love my community. You guys are the best. Roar for my new cheer badge. Thanks, Bandit. Stop man waiting in the sky. Things you like to me. Bloop 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 Yes, put it all- I kinda wish these guys had like little robot arms too. Or like an the same robot arms as the other ones, but like three on each side like a centipede. Hey coffee sip! Thanks bud! Now have the thousand cheer badge. Woo! Which you can't see right now because I think it's being overridden by the number one badge position. Chat- uh chat badge. You've got you've got too many badges. What do you get? You get this thing the fuck out of here. The fuck out. Hey, what asks? Soul nine. We are in soul nine, and we're doing okay. Martian days consist of nearly twenty five Earth hours. Cool. Good to know. Can make room world pawns breed easier. Than these damn marshes. Oh my god, I know. These people just don't... Even the religious types. Y y you know, they're, they're just all... Non-horny. Oh shit! Okay, that worked. Shoot it away. Are there disasters in this game? Yeah, one just, one, one just flew, floated out of my... And, uh, later we should have some Mrs. Magnus. Is there a way, like, donations and, like, a cheer? Use bits? Hey, Dabo! Dabo, son, na 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 Thanks for the cheer. Oh, buddy. My cat's sitting next to me, like, like, sprawled out with his belly in the air. It worked. Blowing the Dust Devil away worked. I blew the Dust Devil, and it worked. Ah, speaking of Mrs. Magnus, I just heard her come home. Okay, launch, you son of a bitch! I need to get the, uh, the Explorer Doodles going. Milestone Bye! Achieved. Hey, babe. Do my, do the kids need to be fed? Uh, they do need to be fed, but she's been pooped already. Thanks. Yes, you took a big poop, didn't you? That's a big pooper. Alright, head on home! Okay, alright, unload. There we are. Yeah, that was Mrs. Magnus. <laughs> oh man! Hey, Lord Cucumber! Oh, you're on your son of a bitch. You're on your lunch. Thanks for stopping by on your lunch. Damn you, Cucumber! Cucumber, there was there was a race for first place, and then Cucumber just came in and was like, "Fuck it!" Sector scan. Ooh! Where was that? Oh, sweet. Hey, babe. Um, because it's Monday, the, 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 the uh -huh. bit leader reset, yeah. and, um, a couple, King Stubbers and Bandit and a couple other people were, like, doing little bits and one-upping each other and one-upping each other and one-upping oh, each other, funny. and then Lord Cucumber's on his lunch right now and came in and was just like, nope, mine! <laughs> Too poor for this shit. <laughs> it, it, the, the, every bit counts, Lord, uh, Lord Cucumber. Every, uh, Bandit. Bandit, every, Bandit, yeah, I know. Bandit. I know. Every bit counts for us. It's, it's, it, everything's appreciated. Think of it- think of it this way. You can watch one ad and cheer for me, and that's more than if you watched, like, every video I posted on YouTube. 